Tonight I'm doing Ink on Yamba at the Carnival of Blood. Um, the Final Girl board game. Uh, I'll be doing Extreme Horror Mode. And I'm using Charlie as the final girl. Her special final ability is during the action phase, you may lose three hearts to take the critical blow action card directly into your hand. So, kind of a brutal one. But, uh, you know, in a pinch situation, if you have the health. Uh, the Carnival of Blood has this, uh, ooh, let me go up here, has this uh, Divine Wrath card um, that can screw things up. But uh, I'm basically another one. So you have to deal with like two of those. Can you see there? You can't see it on that. Okay. So the items come up randomly. I know I, I didn't put in Charlie's special item. Is uh, there's the Forest of Mirrors. I mean, Forest of Horrors, which has the disguise and makeup kit. When an enemy specifically targets the final girl, you may use the disguise and makeup kit to treat yourself as a victim. The enemy will... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. The enemy will then target the nearest victim instead. Ugh. The House of Mirrors has the crystal ball, and that's once... Action phase, you can roll a die and one to four, nothing happens. If you get a five or six, you can look at the next tarot card and place it on either the top or bottom of the tarot deck. And the things to astonish, which is over here, which is actually where I'm beginning, uh, is the energy drink. Discard this during the action phase and choose one of the following. Uh, you can up the uh, time by three or move one space. And I'm on it right now, so maybe I'll try and quickly grab it. Or maybe not. I, you know, you don't start with a search card. This is a weird setup. Everybody's in the bottom of the board. Uh, Inkanyamba is over here in an edit. And, you know, you got two people in the big top, four people in this just bl hanging out in this blank area. No laughing matter for this setup, which is more, I guess, for Geppetto, because uh, I think there's a whole thing about the puppets laughing, the whole theme going on there. Um, is anybody, uh, these two are two away from this, the carnival exit. Okay, so he would go to the big top. Those are the people uh should look into getting, getting out of there. Um, uh, this is the, uh, in this, uh, location, there's traps. There's one trap in each of the searchable locations. And there's, I don't know, there's, well, let's see, there's three traps, potentially, in the tarot deck, depending on what random ten cards I drew. Um, so here we go, drawing the first event. It is mirrors everywhere. What does that say? I think I got him. I don't know. So you don't know. So it's like you're fighting him in the house of in the house of mirrors, and he's like, he's like a million different uh, views of him. If you attack and there are one or more victims in your space, a victim dies for every one you roll. Wow. So you want to try and avoid attacking him when there's victims in my space. The mirrors confuse the situation. Uh, Alright, so... Starting off... 
with. I guess I'll start off with a focus. I always do. Yeah, come on. There we go. Uh, focus. I got one. So this goes down to five. This goes down to three. I will walk. Yeah, I get. Uh, I got to discard if I want to walk. What if I don't discard? I lose a extra time, potentially a card. Uh, I could stick around here, do that search, but I, gotta get, I wanna get moving here. If I go over there, he's gonna come in to attack me, and I could do a guard. Could try that. All right, in any case, short rest, weak attack. So this goes down one. It does. One space. Hmm. I can move up here. And I'll immediately be in a space to try and get some people out of there. But I'm kind of thinking there, and really stop him. I, I can, because uh, these victims are closer. But I'm gonna need a guard because he uh, could very well attack me if I go there. And how much do I have? I have four. Huh? I could grab a retaliate. If I grab a retaliate, then there's not a whole lot I can do the next turn, especially if I have to discard this stuff. So I could just get a guard and a sprint. Um, how much does he have? He has nine. I don't have much. If I get just the retaliate, I'm taking a chance that he does actually move to me. She may not. So that okay, I'm not gonna do that then. Two. I'll get the guard. I got a walk and a focus. You get two close calls, so I have other cards to throw away. I didn't get the distraction. Well, I don't have much uh, much time to spend here. All right, I'll just get the sprint. He is. <clears throat> All right. If the killer wrath is at one to two, increase it by one. All right, we'll move up to three. So if it gets unleashed, the horror track goes up one. All right, now I reveal a terror card. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, unleash it. So terror track goes up to four. I mean, the horror track. Increase the Killer Wrath equal to the number of action cards in hand. One, two, three, four. I hate those, man. Because they just jam it way up. Now it's at seven. All right, now he's going to move to a victim. He moves at a speed two. Oh, man. He's just going to, like, I should have just gone to that space. Um. So is he going to go south or into the big top? Probably gonna head down here. You know, it's the beginning of the movie, so he's gonna hit the outliers first. Uh, what is that? I got a hair in there. Yellow. Ah. All right, he's gonna move into there. Then he's gonna attack one. It's gonna bring the bloodlust up one. And now it is my turn. I don't have much. A guard that I didn't use. I have a sprint and a walk and focus. Ah, do my focus. Ah. 
Ah, son of a bitch. Ay, ay, ay. Because I don't really have any... Ah, if I get rid of cards, I need to do stuff. Oh, I forgot that uh, token at the bottom would panic. So I gotta deal with that. Actually, I'll deal with that now. I got... I got a four and a four. I'll remember that. Well, let's roll another die. Two. He would panic actually towards me. Um, I could move him over to the clown car. All right, maybe I should do that. Oh, I did this focus already. Yeah, but if I knew that guy was there, let's see. I'd probably still focus. I don't know. Son of a bitch. Well, let me. Re I'm redoing my turn because now that guy's there. And I like the idea of moving more than focusing. I guess that's kind of cheating, but uh, I forgot the panic phase. Um, so if I can get him moved over, I can save that guy. So I would sprint. Ooh, I got two successes on that. I lose one time. I move three spaces. So hmm, maybe I can save somebody else too here. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, so I can save two people with that. But then I'm at the clown car. Or I can just save that one guy. And then I'm at the big top. We're ready to save those two guys. But he is either going to target me or the Forest of Horrors. One, three. All right, I will go one, two, three. I will save two. It's important to bring that horror track down. So I am going to choose to do that. Bring it down to two. All right, now I could try to focus. So if I can bring this down. Ah, oh, man. Got to sell my walk and my guard. Uh, four. Bring this down. Not wanting to do that. Take these back, and I have four. I need that atonement. That's a three. Mm. Oh no, atonement's a two. All right, how many? Do I, have? I have four. Get the atonement. If I do that, there's not a whole lot else I can do other than that. I got one walk attack. I mean, one walk card. I need that sprint. Search the House of Mirrors. Atonement, I need two. I'll take a sprint, I guess. And I could also sell the weak attack and a short rest. But they're fine as cards I can get rid of. I can sell those and get close calls. In case I desperately need to re-roll. But usually I don't do that. I don't usually do that. 
do that, but who knows? Whoa, okay. Short rest, weak attack, guard. Walk, focus. Alright, Econ Yumba. Attacks in a space, nothing. New terror card. And the uh, Wrath is above two, so that doesn't kick in. Disrespected him, and now he wants their blood. There are no victims on the board, there are. So he will move to a victim and attack twice. Increase Wrath equal to the number of victims killed this turn. Jesus. Man, it's going up to nine. This wrath is a monster. Oh, I'm playing extreme horror mode. That means I need uh, need to get it down another one. Did I roll three dice? Did I cheat the game already? I think I just... Let's see, I got a sprint... I think I cheated. I think. I don't know. Um, I mean, I could just say I'm not playing extreme horror mode. Just I'm not cheating. All right, I guess I'm not playing extreme horror mode this time. Since I already screwed it up. <laughs> so scratch that. Uh, screw up everything. Jesus. He moves two. Closest is here. He's going to kill the two people in here. Just going to move this up. Bloodlust goes up to there. It reveals the dark power. Which is Feast of Anger. Whenever the uh, wrath increases, Inkayamba recovers a heart. Whenever wrath increases... Inkanyama recovers one heart. So I guess if it goes up a bunch, he still only recovers one heart. Or would it do it for like he, he goes up by four? Do you recover four? I don't think so. That's not what it says. But I'm, never, I'm not sure. Some of these can be. I don't like how some of these cards are written. Well, he killed two. So now I increase the wrath equal to the number of victims killed this turn. So it goes up two. Goes up to nine, so he would recover a heart, but he's full health anyway. All right, atonement, focus, sprint. And I got three. I guess I got to do atonement. I'm no longer doing extreme horror mode. Screwed that up. Playing the atonement. Two successes. Ooh, if I play two cards, I can get it down. Sprint, close calls, focus, and walk. All right, I'll play these two. That will de that will give me three successes, and I can decrease the wrath to one. All right, one more thing I'm doing. That didn't cost time, right? Nope. Should be at six. I am now going to sprint. Not even sure where I'm going to sprint. I'd love to save the two guys over here, but kind of far away. I might be kind of doomed. One success. Throw away my walk and focus and move another space. In their case, this goes down. Five, one, two, three. One, two. Ugh. So I'll go there. 
I'm not able to search for anything right now either. This sucks. Focus and walk. All right, so I'm at five. I'm not going to buy a distraction because I have a focus. In fact, I got two focuses coming to me here. Or another one coming. Weak attack, walk, short rest. Five. Sprint for two. Sprint for two. Maybe I should get the distraction. Maybe I should sell a card. I want to have that. Sell a card and get the retaliate for the future. All right, how many cards we got? I could get an improvise. Hopefully that goes well. Although I don't have a lot of great cards. Alright, I'll try the improvise because I don't know what else to grab here. Sprint to close calls. And now it is his turn. So the Rathen goes up by one to two. Let's get tax in this space. No one's there. He's coming, and there's nothing we can do. There are no victims on the board. Yes, there are. He discarded. So the Horde Track goes up once, and so now we're out of. Back down to two dice. Then he moves once and attacks towards the victim. Damn, I knew it. I knew it. Got one attack, takes out one victim, and the bloodlust goes up. Yay, yay, yay. All right, that guy's going to panic. Three. Maybe we can get him to safety. We gotta get him to safety. We're gonna focus. Only two dice. We gotta get that thing. Alright, we did it. Thank God. Alright, we're back down to five. I never get that. We're gonna improvise. We really need two successes here. Alright, I need to discard two cards. Short rest. I guess the weak attack. I'm not going to use that. Attack. All right. Now all threes and fours on this turn will automatically be successes. Let's sprint. Ah. ah. Damn. Only one success. Goes down. Boom. Did I lose a time from something? Oh, yeah, I lost a time from that. Okay, so I'm down to four. I moved two spaces. I'm going to move over to here. And I got to walk. And play. Two successes. Which means this goes down to three. And I move two spaces. So boom, save them, move back. All right, I can take two time, move two move one spaces, or bring the horror track down. Um, let's see. What do I got? I got to walk and focus. What about these guys? They need to go to the clown car. I get over to them. All right, that's what I'll do. Using those, I'm moving over these these guys here. 
All right, we're going to focus or walk. Let's do it all. We got uh, threes and fours or automatic successes this turn, so I'm going to use up my hand, which is a bad idea because then I'll have nothing to do next hand. But I need, uh, but the improvise is going. So while the improvise goes, I'm going to take advantage. That's two successes. Two and I walk two spaces. All right, one. Let's see. Let's see what's furthest away from him. One, two, three. Wait a minute. Let's walk two spaces. So, going to the house of mirrors and going down to there. Three. One, one, two, three. They're both three away. And this. This this one's searchable, so take oh, I can only take two. What am I doing? Take two with me. And that's it, and I'll focus. Alright, I got two successes there. That's good. Time went up to two. This goes down. Alright, so I can buy four. And I have no cards in my hand. Uh, so I definitely want that sprint. There's only one? There's only one. Alright. Take that. Put these back. If I can save these two people, I get to my final ability. What am I doing? Focus, walk, walk. I really meant to be doing this in extreme horror mode, but I screwed it up right off the bat. This goes to six. And now, his turn. All right, Wrath is a two, so it goes up one to three. He attacks people in the space, no one in the space. New terror card. Misty Ambush. All victims at or adjacent to the Forest of Horrors, which are none, panic. For any one's roll, the victim is killed. If at least one victim is killed, horror goes up. If no victims were killed, resolve the next tarot card. Damn it. In other words, hey, you're doing good. We're going to screw you worse. Move you closer to the, the end of the game. If there are no victims on the board, there are. It's going to draw the next tarot card. Otherwise, horror track goes up one. We're still in green. He moves to the victim, moving three. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I'm at three. Ah, I was worried about that. He can do that, right? Yep, he can reach. One, two, three. Kills one guy. Track goes up. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, and that guy panics now. Five, no, six. Oh, he goes to the exit. Hey, fine by me. Fine by me. All right, well, it's not much I can do. I got to sprint in two close calls. So I guess I'm sprinting. Oops. All right. One success, or I can spend my cards and go three spaces. This will go down to five. So, one, two, one, two, three. Maybe I should uh, just do the two, and then I can potentially search the House of Mirrors. Maybe buy some card card. Because saving them, they might be doomed on the next. They may, be, may marry well, very well may be doomed. I don't know. I'm going to go down here though. One, save this guy. 
And with that, I will move the horror track. Or should I take the two time? Because I uh, do need some cards. Yeah, I will take the two time. I'll move it up to seven. All right. So that was a win. I was at the. All right. I was at the. Uh, thing. I'm gonna move back now. It's my second. And I guess that's my turn. Now I take these cards, got all my free cards, six, seven, eight, and I'm at seven, so I can buy a lot here. Maybe I should buy a Retaliate, you might have to attack me here. I can buy a Furious Strike. Buy a Retaliate, a Sprint, what is that, six? I'll sell one of my close calls and get a search in case I want to search in here. I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Hopefully, he attacks me because I bought the retaliate. Um, what goes there? Sprint. This goes to six. Killer Ath is. One to two, increase it. Oh, it's not at one to two anymore. Uh, draw a tarot card. Nobody in a spot. Well, I'm in a spot. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Oh, he will. Oh, shit. I didn't even think about that because now he may attack me twice. Yee, yee, yee. I did not think about that. That was a mistake on my part. Uh, all right, I'm rolling three dice here. Got the retaliate. Two successes. Nice. Ignore all attacks. Okay, and I do two damage to him. Now, draw a new terror card. Oh, looks like I may get nailed. Discard a random iron card. Damn. So he's going to attack me again. Shit. I got a new event, though. I should put it here. Employee transport. Looks like someone left the keys in the cart. Place the golf cart token in any of the four corner spaces. During upkeep, you enter up to two victims in the space with the golf cart. May drive it up to two spaces, but the golf cart must stay on the outer path. If the golf cart is driven into a space with an enemy, you may discard it to do three damage to that enemy. Ooh, I like that one. Well, if I try to save these victims... Ooh, I'd probably bring them to the clown car. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, maybe I'll uh, put it up there. All right, I don't have a clown car token. I mean, I don't have a golf car token. Eventually, when the second wave ships, I'll get the mini, so I never bothered punching the tokens. So here's my golf cart. It's a crystal ball. I'm putting it at the carnival. All right. Discard a random item card. I don't have one. If you have none, discard the top card from the nearest item deck, which would be the one I'm standing on, the House of Mirrors. So the crystal ball is gone. And he's going to attack me. And I have nothing. I didn't. I did not think about that. Otherwise, I would have grabbed a guard card. Uh, he's going to knock me down, too. Okay. Now it's my turn. And I got a bunch of cards. 
six. So it should go here. Oh, no, it doesn't. Search. Maybe I'll find something there in the House of Mirrors that's good. All right, I can play two cards and check two items. I don't want to use the weak attack. We need one focus. All right, I'm playing these two. All right, time goes down five. And let's see what we got here at the top two items. Ooh, the steel bear. There. Oh, I forgot. There's forgot about that. Son of a bitch. I would have just. I uh, wouldn't have done that had I. Uh, I got the pepper spray. If I had remembered that, I wouldn't have gone for two items. There's traps in these decks. Totally forgot. Damn. I lose a heart. You must spend two time to remove the trap from your leg and cannot move again until you do. Well, I'm doing that now. Discard this once the trap is removed. Son of a bitch. I lost a lot of time. Hey, hey, hey. I totally forgot about these traps. Hey, hey, hey. Mm. Is that right? It just gets discarded? Huh. I gotta. Uh, I need... Well, I will sprint. Sprint the hell out of here. Try and get save those two guys and get the golf cart. Ah, I gotta throw away two. Oh, what do I want to throw away? Focus, a walk, because I got a close call. Short rest. I mean, I can use that. I already lost two health. What am I playing here? The sprint card. All right, that'll move me two spaces. I need those move cards. He's going to come after us, though. Son of a bitch. All right, I'm going to take a chance and go with a short rest. That allows me to move two. I'm in the space with the people. Victims, I'm going to walk. Did I lower my time? I think I did. I think I did. Retaliate, that didn't matter. All right, then I did the search. That brought it down to five. And that brought it down to four. All right, so yeah, I should be at four. I did a walk. So that goes down to three. I got one success. Or I could throw away my focus and walk and make it two successes. Or I can take a chance and go for it and, and walk it again. Maybe I would have two, but I'd have to have two successes. I have to roll really well. Uh, well, all right. If okay, so I move one space. If I want to discard, walk, focus, and walk, I can move another space. I can just wait here, sprint on the next turn. I only have three time. If I go two, 
most likely, um, that's going to bring it, the time down to two. I'm just going to go there and hope, hope that he doesn't move into our space, but he probably will. Probably will. But if I can just save one of these guys, I'll get into my final ability. I don't want him to kill anybody. The terror track will move up to four. Um, so I'm just going to stay where I am there. And now I have three, so I can need this sprint. Get this close call. Short rest, close call, sprint, focus, search, Italia. For I do have that pepper spray. I shouldn't forget about that. Uh, all right, what's happening now? It's his turn. Wrath does not go up. It's above two. Attacks in his space. There's nobody there. Here we go. What happens? Ah, he's going to move. He's going to move to us. Let's see. Three. Yep, he's going to kill somebody. Hopefully the last victim does not panic in a way that makes it hard. Unleash Wrath. Oh, man, I don't have a focus card. I do. It's going to go up. Increase Wrath equal to the number of victims that have been saved. Oh, son of a bitch. That's five. Man, Wrath just... When Wrath goes up, it just goes up. All right. It's going to move to the closest victim. Three, which is right next to him. It's going to kill somebody. Uh, and the wrath. Now he moves at four. And that is that. It's my turn now. I gotta save this guy. Should I do the focus or should I just try to sprint with two car with two dice? Just need one success. And I can get in that golf card. I can uh Hmm. Well, this should be at six. Focus walk. All right, I will do the focus. Roll two dice. Whoa. Ah. Oh. Ah. Ah, I have to discard two cards if I want to make that something, and I don't want to do that. Could play this close call and re-roll, but then I lose two time anyway. Oh, what a waste of a focus. Because I lose two time and re-roll. I lose two time anyway. Ah, why did I do this? I shouldn't have focused. Shouldn't have focused. Son of a bitch. Why did I focus? All right, I'm playing the sprint card. Ah! <laughs> well, I'll have to take a damage. I could play the close call and try and re-roll this. But it may not be any better. And if it's the same, I have screwed myself out of two more time. But it could be better. I need those two spaces. All right, I'm doing a close call. Down to two. Well, we got one success. I think that's good enough. Uh, yeah, this goes down to one. That's not good. 
uh, move two spaces, and I'm going to save this guy. That brings the horde track up to one. All right. And what's the rules on the golf cart? Don't cost me anything. During upkeep. Oh, during upkeep, I can drive it up to two spaces. Hmm. Oh, man. He's going to attack me, too, now. And I can't... Let's see. Should I spend my walk to get a guard card? Oh, wait. I unlocked my final ability. Which is probably useless now, because I'm too weak. Can now discard three to take the critical blow card into hand. One. Could spend this walk to get a guard. I won't be able to do anything in the next turn. He uh, damages me. He's going to damage me for two. All right. Uh, all right, I got a plan here. It's kind of dangerous. Sell that, take the guard card. So I think he'll probably attack. He attacks in a space, nobody is in a space. Oh, I could have gotten atonement. Aye, aye, aye. Um, let's see what happens. Terror card. Oh, that's not good because my terror, my wrath is huge. Uh, unleash wrath. Unleash wrath. Huh. I gain... Wait a minute. According to this, I am way up in the Wrath card. Level 8. I guess I get health back. It doesn't say I lose health. It says I gain health. Weird. Okay. I gain a health. I gain a health. This Horde Track goes up 1. I'm now down to back down to 2 dice. Uh, he's going to target me, move to me, which he can, and he's going to attack. Oh, and the Wrath went up, so Inkan Yamba recovers a heart. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did it, it increased before, right? Five, six. Wait a minute. Did I do in did I increase it yet? And that's my No, I unleashed it. Oh, I always forget where I am. Have I just had it at At this hellacious amount for this time? Oh, no, this was the last turn, right. Unleash it, unleash it, increase. I'm looking at the wrong card. So, yeah, he would have restored his entire health due to his dark power. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He would have restored it. All right. So, unleashed it. So, he moves to me. He attacks me. I have a guard card. But I don't have a guard card for his next attack that he's going to use. Hey, wait a minute. Why are these here? Did I forget to take cards? Where are we? We're at the terror thing. Why are these here? I can use these. All right. I think I just forgot to take those.
Hey, hey, hey. Horrible. Sprint and walk. All right, so that's where I am. I have a short rest, a focus, a weak attack, a walk, and a guard. He has moved to me. He's attacking me due to the increase in wrath, not due to the unleash, I mean. I'm rolling two dice with a guard. Ah, I got a... What is he going to do? He's going to do two damage to me. I have to... Discard two to keep that from happening. The weak attack sucks. Don't think I'm going to walk. So I'll get rid of these two. Reduce it by two. There. Now he's going to move to the closest victim. Which there are none. So he's going to target a final girl, me, and he's going to attack me, and he's going to nail me down to two. Ah, oh, that was... man. He's going to use that special ability to get the critical blow card. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. That's the end of that. Oh, you know it's not. I forgot to increase it. Increase Wrath equal to the Horror level. Horror level's 2. So I'm up to 10. Wonderful. Wonderful. It's my turn. And, well, I'm going to do the upkeep phase here. Place the, I can uh, drive it up to 2 spaces. I have to stay on the outer path. I can do three damage to him, which is probably what I should do. I don't think I can get away from him. He's got, he can walk forward. So I'm just going to go drive the golf cart over to here and then drive it right back. And that'll discard the, uh, discard the guard, discard the um, thing. So I did three damage to him. And it is now my turn, my normal turn. And I have a focus and a short rest. So not much. I will try the focus. Success. Five. I can now roll three. Do I short rest with three dice? Um, he's going to be attacking me. All I can do is retaliate. Oh, I got the pepper spray. Oh, I should have used it on that last one. All right, well, maybe use it on this one. See how bad it is. Let's focus. No, I mean, let's uh, short rest. All right, we got one success. I don't have any cards, so I have to bring it down. Four, and then gives me an extra heart back. Um, interesting. Now I can use my ability. I could uh, I could buy the critical blow card with that. And that'll give me an extra die. All right, so here's my plan. I'm gonna buy the critical blow. This might be silly and dangerous, but I'm gonna do it. And I get these, get these cards. I focus and walk. I'm down to four. So I'll buy the retaliate as well. Let's see. He's gonna, he's gonna attack me. Ah, I wish I could get another card. This better work out. I only got so many dice. All right. I'm going to have to roll well here, but I'm kind of desperate. OK, 
kind of desperate. Goes to six. And. Oh, wait a minute. Was I going to play the. Uh, no. Uh, but now I'm. Now I roll four dice. He is going to attack me. So I got the retaliate. If the terror card goes bad, I have the I have the pepper spray. I'm rolling four dice. All right, two successes. Ignore all damage, which I will do. Uh, and I do two damage to him. Whenever Wrath increases, Inkayamba recovers a heart. What if, I mean, it's already at 10. What if I get a tarot card that says increase? Does that count? All right. Because I can't increase it anymore. Here we go. What's the tarot card? There are no victims on the board. Discard and draw the next tarot card. There are no victims. What does the pepper spray say? Killer is in your space. You may discard this to immediately end the killer phase. No other remaining movement, attacks, and any other effects. Oh, I could have discarded it and got the got rid of the whole original attack. Oh well, I wanted to use that retaliate. He's not coming in. Is there any reason to stop it now? I mean, if it comes up again, it's just a discard. I got one card left. So I could discard this now and the okay, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the pepper spray, even though that card is uh useless, just so the finale won't come up. I discard the uh pepper spray. All right, it is now my turn, and I have a critical blow, which can do three damage to him. Then I'm going to have to do some guarding. All right, critical blow. I'm rolling four dice. Maybe I should focus first while I... Is there any reason to focus first? Not really. If I roll well, yeah. Alright, two successes. Brings his hardage down to three. Down three. Brings us up there. Alright, he's at his one he's got one health left. He's got one health. I have a walk and a focus. Could try the focus, and that'll give me more time, to more cards I can buy. So let's do that. Hopefully, All right? If I uh, bring that up, lower. All right, let's give it a shot. Ah, oh, only got one success. Damn, that means it came up sort of uh, empty. Uh, the time goes down five, but then the horror track goes up one, which brings the time up. So I just kind of lost the card. Son of a bitch. All right, so now I uh, get these cards back. Short rest, focus, weak attack, walk. There's one terror card left. He is going to attack me. So I definitely need to buy a guard. I don't know what's in the terror deck. I could buy the Furious Strike. The Weak Attack. I have that, but I. Uh. Long Rest, no. Guard for two. I definitely need that. Do I want to buy the Furious Strike or another Guard? He's going to attack me. I don't know what's in this last terror card. So I think I have to buy the guard. That's 
four. All right, two guards. It's four, five, six. Ooh, atonement. Maybe I should do that. I don't know what's coming up on this last card. All right, I'll buy atonement. Two guards and an atonement. His turn. All right, he's going to attack me, which is why I bought the guards. Except, need to put these away. Bought the guard. I'm rolling. Ooh, shit. I'm in three. Rolling three dice, and we're down to final health on both of us. So that's two dice. I'm rolling five dice here. I got two successes. So. Or is the attack. And let's see what the terror card brings us. Ah. Okay. Where the hell did the blades come from? Oh, it's a trap. Place the splinning, spinning floor blade trap token in your space. Immediately apply the trap's effects to you and its victims. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's bad. Splinting floor. Spinning floor blade trap. Roll two dice for each result. Do the following. Uh oh. I could be dead. Damn it. Why couldn't it have been just something I could guard it against? Alright. For. Okay. Spinning floor blade trap. Roll two dice. Uh, can I re... I can't... A close call won't re-roll this one. I don't even have a close call. Well, it looks like I'm dead. Unless I roll two five sixes or have final health, I'm dead. Yep. Yeah, that six would allow me to move a space, and that four gives me damage. All right. I roll an, I'm going to roll nine-sided die, and seven, eight, or nine, I have final health. Alexa, roll a nine-sided die. I rolled a nine-sided die and got four. Yeah, I'm dead. That trap killed me. I couldn't guard against that. I was all planned for a guard. If I had survived that, I could have then attempted a weak attack on him. So I had a good chance there. But it came up with something I couldn't guard against. Oh, that was close. That was real close. I guess in extreme horror mode, I think I would have lost. Considering this mode, I considering a regular horror mode, I lost this one. All right. Well, thank you for watching.